The Texas State soccer team is off to a 4-0-1 start in 2014, the best start in school history. Not only does the soccer team rely on the offense to score goals, but it relies on its backline and goalkeeper, Kaylin Reinhardt, to shut down opposing teams. Reinhardt has started in every game so far this season and has posted four shutouts for the Bobcats. She owns a 0.19 goals against average, allowing just one goal in her five starts. In addition to her low goals against average, Reinhardt has a 92.9% save percentage coming into Friday's contest against TCU. Growing up, I played keeper uh, for ODP for five years, I think, and then the rest was on the field. So, I mean, I've played goalkeeper for, before, so it's not like I'm new to it, but um, I feel like coming from a field player to going to goalkeeper, um, I feel like it's kind of a good thing because I know how field players think and how they react to certain situations and how to read them better than maybe some goalkeepers might because maybe they've never played field before. But I feel like that gave me kind of some knowledge, um, how, like how to do things in the back of the goal. So She came in as a freshman. Um, I'll, I'll just have to tell the story. She was an outside mid player, uh, midfield player. And then she also played backup goalkeeper, and I saw her play backup goalkeeper. And I just saw this innate talent in her, and uh, I asked her to come play goalkeeper for us. And you know, first she wasn't sold on it, but then she came back through and said, "You know what? I can do that." And uh, she started you know, the first game out for us against Texas, and uh, even saved a PK a penalty kick, and uh, and then just kind of grew from there. But then a good battle came on with her, and Natalie, and uh, and then also she had a little bit of injury her freshman year, so that kind of lost the starting role for her. But uh, now she's come back on this year. She knows that she's needed. She, I think she thrives under, and under pressure. Um, and I think that's where you're seeing her do such a great job back there is that there's not always um, a ton of shots on her, but then when there are shots, it's really important. And she's doing a great job of keeping a clean sheet. I feel like from a goalkeeper and like a relationship with our defenders is a big part of the game. Um, I love my defenders to death on and off the field. We have a great relationship and they just, they, they listen to me, you know, like that's a big part. If they didn't listen to me, I don't think we'd be where we're at right now. Um, uh, Kristen, you know, she's one of my best friends off the field. And when she has questions about the game, if she didn't play well, she always comes and asks me like what she could do better. And I always talk to her, you know, as a friend and as a teammate. Um, Liz, she's a freshman this year and I feel like, you know, she's done a great, a great job. I really like her back there and, you know, she listens to everything I have to say without, you know, any question. So, um, I don't know, I feel like my defenders, they're, they're the reason why we have shutouts, not only myself, but of them too. We've been working on leadership all through spring and Kate's, like I said, she's come to realize that the goalkeeper is a, like a coach on the field. She's the one that's going to direct the back line. She's the one that's going to give them feedback and encouragement, but also give them directive and com communicative um, advice on how to deal with situations and problem solve. So I've been very happy with her that she stepped into the role, not just through physical, but mental and as a leadership. Um, so she's done a great job and I'm, I'm really proud of her growth and she's just coming on strong. But again, I think it goes back to that. that she loves she loves pressure. I think she strives under pressure, to tell you the truth. Um, and so that's a good thing to have as a goalkeeper, I believe, because uh, there's going to be times when you get you got to rise to the top, and she's doing it.